Welcome back. Today's vlog is day four of 33 things to do while 33. And obviously one of them is to vlog for a month. So that's why I'm here. Um, today is about my natural hair. My natural hair journey. I'm in need of some help. Seriously. I need... I don't know what texture here I have. I was looking it up. It's numbers and letters. Like, I don't know what that stuff means. I'm clueless. When I decided to go natural was June. I went to my beautician and I said, Jeremy, I'm, let's go natural. Cut it off. He said, you sure? I said, I'm positive. Let's go ahead and just chop this thing off and let me start fresh. I didn't know what my goal in mind was. I know I wanted something carefree. I do not do very well with maintaining hairstyles. Um, I don't do well with wrapping my hair or caring for my hair or greasing my scalp or shampooing. I don't do that stuff well. So I wanted something quick. So he was like, this is like, you could do some wash and go type stuff. So I was game. I love how it is. I, I was initially scared. But this is the thing. I went into this without researching. Yeah. I was just like, you just cut it and we'll go from there. It's just hair. My hair has grown. I have struggled with what products work best for me. Currently, I am using water and echo gel. And then I was just told this past weekend that that's a negative. But it curls it. It keeps me my little curls. But I was told don't do it. Um, originally, I was using Can2 products. But they were leaving my hair white like it was a lot to get it all moistured in it was just a, a lot of white residue so help me out I, I need your help legit uh real quick my hair journey i started out with a head full of hair uh my mama and then put perms in it kitty perms it broke off and it didn't help that i had um, asthma and they did a recall on my medicine so that broke out my hair and took my edges and and put in braids and stuff that took it too but since i went natural they are growing back this stuff used to be bare so i'm i'm happy with the way it looks i'm happy with the fullness of my hair i've always had thick hair i love the curls i love all of this stuff i like it i'm just ready for the big whoosh but anyway so start out with a head full of hair perm uh just for me all that stuff broke my hair out then recall medicine broke my hair out then when i was in high school i didn't do a good job taking care of my hair i was a tomboy i would brush it back and put in a ponytail and then i was good i put a headband on a bandana on a hat on i was good for wearing a hat especially in college my g unit hat. i was good for wearing hats and then leaving like that um, doing my hair or having my hair done consisted of a flat iron. In college, my homegirl Chrissy used to wash my hair because I didn't know how to properly wash my hair until college. Chrissy used to wash my hair. My homegirl Tasha used to perm my hair. And my homegirl Satara used to have that thing fried, dyed, and laid to the side. You heard me? She would go to town with some flat irons. My wraps used to be crisp. They was that. But, and then when I was an adult, I was just like, I didn't really care. My hair was only getting done on special occasions, um, birthdays, holidays, certain things like that. But right now, I need you to help me. Help me. What hair care products do you use? What do you suggest? And I know everybody's products ain't the same. And I know everybody here is different. But help me out. Natural hair in the beginning stages, like I said, I started in June. Can you help a sister out? Deuces.